out of the with the you i never love someone it's that bit is hard love someone you have to keep i don't know i, I i'm very like when i don't hit the note i get upset with myself <laughs> story time uh oh chill what's the question what is the question here uh oh be good crazy is the best by the way iggy i think we can relate right sick it girl says queen sick it you get the craziness from me. Oh, yeah. I get the craziness from Queen. And, and, and we just, we bounce off each other, you know? Can you break the glass while singing? Prob? What? No! I love the, I have only have three of these Starbucks cups. Yeah, I cannot, I cannot waste it. I've never seen story time. What is it? Oh. Well, Vigil, you must ask me a question. Any kind of question, as long as it's a question, you know, within reason, the one that I, one that I could honestly answer you <laughs> comfortably. And um, any kind of question you think of, um, if I can answer it, and I will, I will sort of go into my memories and I'll think of it. And if I can, if I can remember, if I can remember it, whatever that question is, then I will, um, I will share it with you. Basically, you can ask me a question, la. And I'll just answer it. How do you guys? How do you guys keep up with you? How do guys keep up with me? Slip crafty. Wait, what? What? Girls? What do you? Wait, wait, wait. So only guys? How do only guys keep up with you? What do you mean? I'm listening. You have my full devoted attention. Don't dig a hole now. You're digging a hole. The answer to that is they don't. They have nobody. There's none. There's none but, but my chocolates and my computer. Mm. Don't make me sad. <laughs> okay, anyway, anyway, anyway. Are we going back, back into the game? Yeah, we're going back into the game, right? If I missed anyone, I'm so sorry. Wow, Sip a, Sip a Coffee really gave her that energy. Soul Tech, you really get, you get it. There's something, there's something magical about espresso. Or just coffee in general. Can you hear that? Someone upstairs. I should really buy them. Um, look, gotta work. No worries. Beltrezzi, see you soon. I, I really gotta. I gotta put. Um, what are those things that you put under the sticker things that you put underneath the 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 foot, the feet of the chairs, so it doesn't make a crazy sound when you obnoxiously move it across the room and I can hear it. My neighbors. I feel like getting a broom and just going doof, doof, doof. <laughs> Oh! What are you doing? Pop, pop, pop. <laughs> Stop it. I can hear everything. I'm sure they can hear me too. Okay, anyway, what? That wasn't the Zodiac guy. Soft nubbing. Band-aids. Chair socks. <laughs> I've never heard of chair socks. Zara, hello, chill. You've changed your color. I have to say, you stand out more. Red really suits you. <laughs> you should throw hands at your neighbors. Every time I walk past them. <laughs> no, but they live upstairs. You know, our, our paths never cross. I'd have to deliberately stand outside their door, and then when as they come out in the morning, whatever, I'm going to be like... And then walk back downstairs. <laughs> Slipknot fan seven, welcome in. What about the Zodiac Killer? No, don't tell me about the Zodiac Killer though, seriously. But don't say that there's a Zodiac Killer upstairs. No. That dramatic face expression. Ah, it's El Davido. Hi, El Davido. We're giving everyone chocolate and flowers here. Well, flower, plural. Not plural. Singular. I wish it was plural. It's it's only it's only singular. Here, have. Have. But but plural is, is for all of the all of the chocolates. Here. Thanks for the num nums. Here. Have uh, have all the plural chocolates. <laughs> what the hell is happening with us? Come on, man. Happy Valentine's Day to you too. You too. Yum yum. How are you? <laughs> Alright, back to this. Finally. Zara, I asked. You did? You asked me a question? 
Okay, wait, wait, wait. What was the question? Because you redeemed... Oops. I accidentally clicked on Joy Destroy. Furniture pads. Wait. The chill. Ooh, what was your most favorite trip when you were a flight attendant? That's a very good question. Okay. My favorite... My favorite trip when I was a flight attendant, I really loved going to... I really loved going to Melbourne. So I would go, it was like a, um, it, what, it was called like a, um, what was it called? Double sector. So you'd go to, um, you'd, you'd go to one city and then you'd stay overnight. Then you'd go to another city, you stay overnight. Then you'd go back to the first city, stay overnight, and then you'd go home. So, um, so for me, we would go from, it was either like Singapore and then Melbourne, then Singapore, home, or Kuala Lumpur, and then, you know, Brisbane or, Sing or, or Melbourne, and then back to Kuala Lumpur and then home. So um, I loved the one where I would go to Singapore and then I'd go to Melbourne. So in Singapore, I would, um, the first trip I would do nothing. I would just shop, like just look around, see what sales they've got, um, walk around, explore. Um, I was always pretty much, I guess like, it's hard to admit this because you probably won't believe me, but I was more of an introvert. Yeah, I was working as a flight attendant, but when it came to like downtime after flights, um, after my flights, I wouldn't want to... Sorry, I just saw, saw something out there and I was like, what is that? It's an owl. Anyway, I really wouldn't want to hang out with anyone. I would just, I would just go home um, to my hotel room or whatever. And I would just chill or just explore by myself. So anyway, um, yeah, so I go to Singapore and that was great. And then Melbourne. Now in Melbourne, it had the best hotel in the best location. It was right on the, it was right on the outskirts of the city, but you could just walk into the city, like fine, no problems. Um, and I would always be alone. I loved just exploring Melbourne by myself. Um, the coffees are great there. Um, I always found this this cute little bookstore and I'd just sit in the bookstore for hours like a dork. Off on another adventure, <laughs> but I loved we? it. And uh, my favorite, favorite thing to do in Melbourne was actually, um, well, I would go to the gym, but I would wake up really early in the morning before sunrise. And I know that sounds crazy, oh, but yeah, I would do that. I would wake up before sunrise and I would go to the rooftop um, pool and I would swim during, during sunrise. As the sun goes up, I would be swimming. Um, and I had music in my ears because I had a really cool, um, you know, like it's a Sony MP3 thing that you like stick in your ears. And, um, and I would watch as the sun rise, you could see, um, you could see all these like scattered hot air balloons and the sky just looked so, so pretty. And it was one of my favorite things to do. It just, it felt very relaxing. Um, I really enjoyed it. Yeah, and that's pretty much it. That was one of my favorite, favorite destinations. Are you a loner? You wanted to well, speak with not me, anymore. I but yeah, I guess I, I guess I am. You alone, I, I like, I like your message being mentioned alone. your concern about an unusual creature it's weird. that was spotted it's a, it's in the a weird thing, isn't it? That could have been anything. Thanks, you Chill, for asking that question. That I am allowed to leave the castle. I am always careful, mother. Careful. Officer Singer disagrees. Hey, Mr. Hydra. Thank you for the follow. She sent me an owl telling me that she trying to collect evidence Bota of some Chimaru. kind against dark wizards. Is it Poto? How, she what does your name me mean? She's keeping a closer eye on you. I and tried she to Google right. it. I do not want you visiting Hogsmeade for the near future. Uh-oh. But mother! My little gazelle. You My are little well gazelle? intentioned, but you must not Hi, meddle Pato. in the affairs of dangerous people. If someone had meddled in Matabilaland, father would still be with us. I must get to class. Perhaps your friend can get you to listen to reason. Oh. Oh. So frustrating. She so never that... listens to me. She called you her little gazelle. Oh. Is that a term of endearment where you're from? It is specific to me. Oh. I am the unusual creature in Hogsmeade she mentioned. Self-transfiguration oh. is not taught at Hogwarts. So I am gently discouraged from practicing it. However, oh. I am an Animagus. And it is in my gazelle form that I have been able to wander the highlands rather freely until now. Oh, wow. She just got cooler. Chagrin. That is how I managed to spy on Rookwood and Harlow. 
Damn. She is a freaking... Whoa. She transforms. She transforms into, into a gazelle. Or, well, I don't know. I'm guessing. I mean, people would say, though, like... I'm just imagining the conversations with between Rookwood and Harlow. And they see this gazelle. Surely that's out of place. But I don't know. Does she actually transform into a gazelle? I don't know. Dwin's game. She was the last person to visit Pluto before the... Demoted it from being a planet. Are you guys still try to? Are you what? What trip to home? Prob yeah, home. I swear I live under a rhinoceros with an OCD for re rearranging at random times of day and night. Wolf's rain. Dante, you're getting your wand. Good luck. Let us know what what you ended up going for. I'm sorry, but that that's hilarious. Wolf's Rain. You, um... That definitely sounds like uh, an OCD. But, but yeah, rearranging stuff, is, it's not a bad thing. You sound like, uh... You remind me of... What's her name? Monica Geller from Friends. She's very clean. Everything is tidy. You know? Because basically, it went on from killing... killing what, what, what's it? The Zodiac Killer? I mean, it sounds familiar. I feel like it's. I feel like there must be. Um, there must be a um, a Netflix series on this because I I watch a lot of docos on Netflix. Do you choose your? Oh, my back's really sore. Like this, eh? How do you become an enigma? Do you choose your enigma's form? Can you choose what form your animagus will take? Oh no, a person's mm. animagus form is determined by their personality. My mother is convinced that my form is a gazelle because I adapt well to any situation. I believe it is because I can sense danger and keep my wits about me. My aunts were all flight attendants, but they all stopped except one. She loved Tokyo. I never got to go to Tokyo. Never. Were you born in Animagus? Or did you learn to become one? Our father, Animagia, our queen, I think born. I've seen that one. I the don't process think I finished is quite it, elaborate. It involves holding a mandrake leaf in one's mouth Relaxing for an entire solo month, goes dark, yeah. then placing the leaf in a crystal phial so that it is imbued with moonlight, then adding one of your own hairs. And that is just the beginning. Self-transfiguration is this. common among students at Wagadu, but Professor Weasley considers it much too dangerous to teach at Hogwarts. That's where the bullying starts, huh? Zara's kind of just being Zara, it's great. Thank you. Thanks, How does Andy. it feel to transform into an Yeah, animal? downtime. Well, when we the get, first time, we it touch can down. be a bit unnerving. I felt a kind of searing pain and a strong double heartbeat. But it gets I agree, 90s it. guy. He's actually teaching at Hogwarts, that lady, right? And I must say, I find a sense of comfort in the double heartbeat. And I love being well, able to view the world from a different perspective. She doesn't want the, her baby to leave the nest. There's some now troubling times out there sense. at the moment. What an extraordinary ability to have. It is. I love transforming, but Mother is less enthusiastic about it. I'm gonna she says that like no creature, especially one as rare as a gazelle, should be bounding about where poaching has I mean, become so true. prevalent. Imagine if she got <sighs> captured. She claims that she has foreseen tragedy befall me in my gazelle form. But she has used her sight to control me too many times. I no longer believe it. I think she shouldn't. I think she should listen to her mom. She's concerned for your safety. It may be best for you to stay away from Hogsmeade for now. That may be safe, but I do not believe that it would be best. Do Aww. you? You could have fled the moment you discovered that Rookwood, Harlow, and Randrock were after you. But you did not. I choose to act as she's you She's so have. calm. I must she's deal angry. with Rookwood and Harlow, not hide from them. <laughs> My Get mother to the cannot broom. know yeah. where I am all the time. John, you're right. Top tier, Thank top, you for being top here tier, top hat. That rather awkward Isn't it great? Reasons? Hogwarts? Nothing happening. Wait, that's the thing. When, whoa, this guy's stuck. Dude, you gotta climb. You gotta climb it. You gotta climb the stairs. Not walk into it. Oh, this guy. I'll snap you out of it. Nah, he's lost. He's lost. He's gone, guys. He's gone done no point 
Last call. Nice to see you, my young friend. Oh, I think I'm going the wrong way again. 90s guy, no worries. Thank you very much. Have a good one. You take care. It's already three in the afternoon. Oh, wow. Yeah, I mean, it's actually much later over here. It's much later over here. You still have... You still have many, many more hours. Wonder I'd be the most useless animal to turn, to turn into as an enigmas. It's a good point. Z, yes, chill? What is it, chill? Mm, what would be the most pointless animal to turn into as an ignit as an enigmas my gosh it's hard to say that i don't know i mean maybe something small right okay well cats and dogs that's fine but i'm thinking like a frog i don't know but then if you turn into an ant, that's kind of cool, too. Hmm. A hamster. Centurion Swindle, where have you been? Welcome back. I'm a look since I was doing some work. No worries. But I love to watch, watch out of the, eye, the corner of my little eye. Enjoy. Centurion Swindle, I hope work is, um... I hope work's, uh... Work's behaving. Not causing you much stress. Krill? Oh my god, yes. You're just food for the filter feeders. True. Ghost Stark is right. I wouldn't or a limbless sloth. Zara is really a chaotic Gryffindor? No, we're not chaotic. We're not that chaotic. Oh, I knew it. I knew we had to bring a mitt. God damn it. I'm gonna do this one because I think this is oh fine. Let's do the, the emit quest. Meet Sebastian. Okay, fine. Talk to Poppy. Well, these ones are easy. They're just side quests, so whatever. Hmm? Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Why? Sebastian? So far away. Oh my. I was gonna say like a frog, cause like frogs are easily, I'm just, I wasn't even thinking about krill. That's probably the best one. I feel sorry for krill. It's rather dark in there. Never stopped me before. I was thinking frogs, cause frogs are ill. But like, yeah, granted you can live on land, you're, you're an amphibian, you can live on land and in water, but like, what are you doing? And I'm sure you're, you're gonna get, you're gonna get uh, snatched up. You're here. And eaten. Good. Alive. Sebastian, that relic you mentioned. I believe one of Slytherin's students stumbled upon the relic during an assignment to study it's sarcophagi oh, in nice. this catacomb. From it's what I read in a report website. by the nice. students, Good luck. they weren't permitted to take it with them, so I must assume it's still here. As I mentioned earlier, this relic grants its holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. If it's in this catacomb, I have to find it. Okay, Fair. let's go. I need to see her. Okay, let's go. I'm ready to explore the catacomb. Perhaps we can visit Anne when we've finished. Perfect. Ooh. By the way, Ominous has been asking about you. You didn't tell him what we were doing, did you? I didn't, I promise. Good. Ominous would be livid if he knew what we were about to do. Do your Merlin trial, Z. I'll be interested to compare what lies inside to what I've read about this catacomb. Why are you waiting for me, then? This guy, seriously. He's not a gentleman, is he? He doesn't. He doesn't. Oh my goodness, dear snake. Aww. I'm sure that foul smell is the scent of success. Try doesn't even exist. We've already yet. met her, though. At this point, she's still um, she's she's a, she's alive. Oh, cool. At least 
now we know we're not alone in here. Perhaps that was it. That and was the great. Rest of the tomb will be set free. Spiders aren't insects. Don't start. He's like, don't start with me. We're here for a reason. I'd say opening them all is justified. Just give me a second, man. I'm looking for stuff. Jeez. Uh, where is it? Where is it? I think it's this one, isn't it? Wingardium Leviosa. Um. Oh, man. Uh, there. This room is taller than it looks. Stop it. Oops. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to do that. We'll go in there in a minute. First, we need to go here. Ooh. Finding a chest in an inconspicuous loft. Brilliant. Okay. No. All right, let's go. Wait till you hit a full health troll with a killing curse. Ooh, we've been cheesing our troll, all troll uh, battles. I mean, that would be pretty bad, having to constantly looking for nectar to power those hyper wings. But aren't they very pretty? Hyper wings, I like that. That's a good one. Oops. I just don't. Oh. What are you gonna cruise here for everything? Since it doesn't take. Read the world of another spider. I shall sleep that Wait, there's there's am I poisoned or something? What's with the red stuff all over? Oh, it just stopped. Oh, I guess we were poisoned. Bombarda. Interesting. I mean, we might as well. Which way do we go? I guess we'll go this way. Must be poison. Mm. Watch your step. I nearly slipped there. Oh, shoot. Watch your step. I nearly slipped there. Aw. How much he cares. And then does the, does the, the curse on us. Whoops. That was fun. Okay. Happy time zone. Hi, Achli Blech. All this grass. Achli Blech. It no longer feels like a tomb. <laughs> I've Happy times in you too. That underwent expansion efforts and, and ran into problems. Often cavings. Krill like person. And then um, were abandoned. Yeah. Exactly. I think Probably if I had any. Any, mm, any mag Magnus, whatever, any Magus, any Magnus. So wait, have I not done any of the Merlin thingy quests yet? How do I, is it, is it over here? Where is it? Where is the Merlin thingy? Is that the flying one? Oh, they're on the map? Oh, we can't look at the map. Damn it. So it's not part of the quest? Oh, yes. I'm sorry. I remember. I have done a few. I have done a few. I kind of kind of lost interest, to be honest. Do you get something awesome if you do them all? How many are there? I remember it. Yeah, I remember it now. Aw. Kid CDs. Um, I don't actually have any... Any covers or anything like that. But I can give you my, I can give you my website, and that'll take you to um, um, a social, social, social media, like, page where you can choose whichever one you want. I can't speak English today. You can choose whichever one. Um, I would, I would say if you wanted to hear some of my singing. I mean, I normally just do it on stream, 
a cappella with no backing music or anything like that. I just sing. Um, and that's it. I would love to, I would love to have my own music, have my own, um, you know, my own songs, but maybe that's something I can work on this year. Yeah. If it said the word transmog, would anyone know what it means? Oh, this really hurts. I think I've got a problem with my shoulder, everyone. I don't know what's happening. Sitting too many, sitting, sitting for too long. I probably have to do some standing in a bit. I just, I'm so lazy. I'm so lazy to stand. Is your shoulder sore? Yeah, do you think it's because I have the mouse? Because I'm holding the mouse up? Maybe I can put the mouse down here. It's like on my chair. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Oh, did you redeem posture check before? I'm so sorry. It's been hurting since yesterday though, mind you. Just back, back here. So it's kind of like through here. I don't know what it is. It just feels really sore. Like just, if I lift it, it's, I don't know, maybe it's, Maybe it's because I hold the mouse up on the on the armrest of my recliner. Do you model? Says Blazer Jake. Yeah, I do. I've been modeling since I was sixteen, but I haven't modeled in a while. Whenever I get whenever I get any opportunities, of course, um, depending on how much, you know, they they pay you, um, will I take it on? So I haven't actually done any decent modeling job since before COVID. So it's been a while. It's your scapula due to lack of movements or sleeping on that side. License LMT. Ooh, go Stark. Yes, please. Welcome to my welcome to my world. Be my friend. Yeah, I think you know what it is? I've stopped going to the gym for, for a week now and it could be that as well. And I've been streaming for many, many hours. I've been doing like 12 hour streams. Um, 11, 10, 9 hour streams. So it could be that. It could be the fact that my body's just meh. Just tired. Instant friend. Instant friend. Yes, please. Hey, look. Doesn't have to be a woman. It could, if, if you were, if you were a woman and, and you're a massage therapist, I would still want to be your friend. Yes, yes. Uh, can we be friends? Stay. Don't go. Male. Also, your, your male friend, if, if you meet anyone that's that's a male and lends your massage therapist, do you, they don't care? I'm in the wrong business, says Jedi Mind Trick. <laughs> yeah. Uh, wait. We didn't go this way, did we? Now this is the sort of great room I want to be buried in. Surrounded by grandeur. Grandeur and then some. Even an altar with a pile of bones. Lovely. Bones outside a sarcophagus. Oh, seems odd. There's something here by the altar. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. I foolishly mentioned the relic in my report and was reminded to leave it there. Leave it where it lay. Uh-oh. Wait a second, I'm reading. But research must come before my fealty to the rules. I sent something about this relic. I was told that... Stop it! I was told that they chose by... Oh my god. Um, for, uh, therefore, no one was looking at cry to conjure to find. That's it. That's it. What did it. you find? That's it. What did you find? We died. Thank you, Sebastian, for helping me. I was reading a letter. Edgar Rice, welcome back. Consider a career change. Aw. Are you saying we have to start from the beginning? No. Oh. Oh, wow. It really did forget everything. 